This is James Holder for iFilm London. I'm in the O2 Arena today for the Carpe Diem show. With me, I've got British and Commonwealth champion Lee Selby. What's happening, Lee? What's up? I say congratulations on winning the British British title outright, mate. Thank you very much. Not, not many Welsh people do it. Well, not many people do it in general. Yeah. It's a big achievement. Great fight with yourself with Ryan Walsh. Again, totally dominated the fight, picking him off. I spoke to Ryan afterwards. He seemed a bit down, disheartened with his performance. Talk to me a little bit about that. To be honest, I... I, I I didn't think he'd be as good as I. He was a tough, strong, strong fighter, put on a good performance. But um, I'm a level above the the British British boxers now. I think and I'm ready to move on to European. Before the fight, you said you said to me you'd stop you'd stop him in a couple of rounds. You didn't see him going that far. Bit of a shock for yourself today. Um, yeah, he was a better fighter than I thought. I I um I might have underestimated him a bit because the footage I seen of him, he, he didn't look too clever. But he's obviously improved. I think what you said to him kind of wound him up a little bit, to be honest. And, he, he he didn't want to get knocked out, you know. It looked that way, yeah. So I caught him with a big shot, and he said, "No way!" He shook his head. I could see him talking to you in there a little bit. Yeah, yeah. He, he said a few words. Where do you go from here? What's next for you guys? As as your team, like Tony Borg or, or like Sanika said anything? What's going on? Well, I'm mandatory for the European. I think I'm going to be boxing Randall Monroe, and he's he's a big name in Britain, so should be able to make for a good fight. Yeah, absolutely fantastic fight. Is is that belt vacant? Vacant at the moment? It's vacant. Yeah, the the champion. Um, vacated, and then they put me in in with the number one challenger. He he, he didn't want to fight me. And then the next one in line again pulled out, and then they offered that viral Simeon the fight again. He didn't want to fight, and now Randall Monroe's next on the list. What do you think of Randall Monroe? Do you think you can beat him? No, I don't think I can beat him. I know I can beat him. <laughs> he's um, I think he's had he's had his days. He's still a good quality fighter, and it'll be a good another good learning fight for me. I think the people of Barry will be happy back home that you've, you're taking this, this belt back to keeps. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, hopefully they'll be proud of me. When are you going to take us to Barry Island? We hear so many great things, but we don't get invited down. When you're ready, I've invited Coogan about three times. See how much ends up though. Yeah. All he goes on about is women on there. What would you want me to talk about? <laughs> Gavin and Stacey, <laughs> fish and chips, the beach. <laughs> I'm a I'm massive fan of Gavin and Stacey. Coogan likes a bit of Gavin and Stacey. Well, come down then. Right. Yeah? All right, listen. Lee Selby, AK okay, Peanut. Well done on your win. Appreciate it. And we'll catch up soon. This is James Holder with Lee Selby for iPhone London. Thank you.